Could you ever imagine that this little devil can hack a whole system in minutes? Today, we have something quite exciting and intriguing lined up for you. We'll be diving into the world of hacking gadgets available on Amazon. Hold your snacks and enjoy what we have brought to you. The top 11 hacking gadgets you can find on Amazon right now. Wireless Adapters Any hacker exploring Wi-Fi networks needs a dependable wireless adapter because of their excellent signal reception and compatibility with a wide range of hacking tools. These adapters are commonly recommended among hackers. Wireless adapters are used to examine and evaluate the security of IoT devices, link intelligent buildings, intelligent machines, and other IoT parts. These amazing devices are used to perform Wi-Fi network penetration testing. They can locate vulnerabilities in the network and suggest changes to strengthen its defenses by simulating different attack scenarios. This adapter will give you an advantage in your hacking endeavors, whether you're running penetration tests or sniffing wireless traffic. So, if you're a tech enthusiast, go get a wireless adapter from Amazon. Flipper Zero. Our second entry is Flipper Zero, a portable hacking tool. It may look like a toy, but geeks, professional hackers, and pen testers use this special hacking tool to reveal vulnerabilities in the environment around them. This device is an effective and simple tool for looking into physical world cybersecurity. It can read the signals that wireless devices emit, but it can't control every wireless device that crosses its path. This ability enables it to disclose a significant amount of data about a variety of electronic devices. Flipper Zero is primarily a learning tool created to change how users perceive the digital devices in their environment and increase accessibility to cybersecurity information. Much of the technology and techniques Flipper Zero uses have been around for years. Flipper Zero just makes them slightly more accessible and user-friendly. That's why tech experts do have a Flipper Zero in their toolkit. And if you're one of them, you can buy yours from Amazon through the given link. Bash Bunny Another clever hacking tool that makes penetration testing easier is the Bash Bunny. This small, portable device can simulate different USB devices and run payloads to quickly exploit target systems. Due to its dual Ethernet ports, the Bash Bunny can serve as a network bridge between the attacker's system and the target system. This makes it possible to access and manage the target system remotely. Both the human interface device and a mass storage device can be simulated by the Bash Bunny. This opens up more attack options because it can simultaneously appear as a storage device and a keyboard. Now, if you're looking for a machine to get help in penetration testing, you should buy a Bash Bunny. We forgot a plus point of this machine that you can create custom attacks and test the security of different machines effectively. Quite impressive, isn't it? Land Turtle Another unique hacking tool for covert operations is called the LAN Turtle. It has the appearance of a typical network adapter and can be plugged into a target network to give the hacker remote access. The LAN Turtle requires little setup and is simple to use. Once connected to a target system, it functions as a plug-and-play device and instantly establishes network connectivity. The LAN Turtle has a potent processor and enough storage to hold various payloads and tools for network penetration testing. You can interact with the device and the target network from a distance using the LAN Turtle's remote access and control features. Its stealthiness makes it a great option for carrying out network-based attacks and learning insightful information. And if you're a tech enthusiast and you want to play with network penetration, buy yourself a LAN Turtle. Wi-Fi Jammer Next on our list are the Wi-Fi Jammers. These tools are controversial but fascinating hacking tools that can interfere with wireless networks within their range. Wireless signal jammers can successfully block nearby Wi-Fi signals, causing problems with network connectivity and preventing users from connecting to Wi-Fi networks. On the same radio frequency bands that Wi-Fi networks use, Wi-Fi jammers emit radio frequency signals. Network connectivity problems are brought on by this interference, which obstructs communication between Wi-Fi devices and access points. The two frequency bands used by Wi-Fi networks, 2.4 GHz and 5 GHz, are where Wi-Fi jammers typically operate. Depending on the device's power and design, a Wi-Fi jammer can interfere with wireless signals over an alternate region. Some jammers can disrupt Wi-Fi over a small area, while others may have a wider range of interference. These Wi-Fi jammers are crucial for security measures in a specific area and are available on Amazon. Raspberry Pi Zero W With the appropriate software and upgrades, the Raspberry Pi Zero W is a flexible and reasonably priced single-board computer that can be turned into a potent hacking tool. Its small size makes it perfect for projects requiring portability or just a little of space. 
The Raspberry Pi Zero, like the other Raspberry Pi models, includes GPIO pins that let users connect to external devices, like sensors, displays, and other electronics. Users can use micro SD cards to store data into the operating system, since it lacks an onboard storage option. It's perfect for a variety of hacking applications, from setting up a portable hacking station to creating specialized hacking devices, thanks to its small size and built-in Wi-Fi. It's a budget-friendly gadget, making it accessible to hobbyists, students, and DIY enthusiasts, and it's available on Amazon right now. Hack RF1. In our next entry, we have Hack RF1, a powerful software-defined radio platform. The Hack RF1 covers a wide frequency range from 1 MHz to 6 GHz. This extensive frequency coverage allows it to receive and transmit signals from a broad spectrum of radio frequencies. This gadget is ideal for exploring and experimenting with wireless protocols, including RFID, Bluetooth, and more. Ethical hackers use it for analyzing and securing wireless communication systems. Overall, HackRF1's flexibility, openness, and powerful capabilities make it a valuable asset for a wide range of applications in the field of radio communications, security research, and wireless technology exploration. This tool is designed for a wide range of applications and is especially favored by radio enthusiasts, hackers, and ethical hackers for various purposes. Keygrabber Nano a small hardware keylogger called the Keygrabber Nano can be used to record keystrokes on a target system. It's incredibly small and discreet, making it hard to see when connected to a target system and simple to conceal. This tool doesn't need to be installed or configured and is simple to use. It only needs to be plugged in between the computer's keyboard and USB port to begin recording keystrokes right away. The Keygrabber Nano can be used by ethical hackers and security experts during penetration tests and security evaluations. They can identify security gaps and raise public awareness about the dangers of keyloggers by obtaining the owner of the system's express consent. Additionally, it can be used to keep tabs on workers' computer usage for compliance, productivity, or security reasons. While keyloggers can have legitimate purposes, they can also be misused to steal sensitive information. Shortly, this tool can be used for employee monitoring, parental control, recovery of data and passwords, and security assessment of the system. Bad USB. We now have the infamous Bad USB, which is a more contentious device. The way Bad USB works is by reprogramming a USB device's microcontroller to make it look like a different kind of USB device than it initially appears to be. It might pretend to be a keyboard, mouse, or even a network adapter. This gadget appears as a genuine keyboard or other peripheral. This USB device can run malicious commands that have been pre-configured once it's connected to a laptop, making it possible for a variety of cyber attacks to be launched for the sake of compliance, productivity, or security. Bad USBs can be dangerous and pose significant security risks and should be used by a tech expert. If you're an expert, you can get this tool from Amazon, Ubertooth. The next item on our list is Ubertooth an open-source Bluetooth hacking tool. It's made to analyze and evaluate Bluetooth communications and vulnerabilities for security researchers, ethical hackers, and penetration testers. The Ubertooth can capture and passively monitor Bluetooth packets, which enables researchers to examine the traffic and spot potential security flaws. Researchers can simulate different attack scenarios and test the security of Bluetooth-enabled devices because of its ability to actively inject Bluetooth packets. With its ability to record Bluetooth data exchanges, including audio, pairing requests, and other data, it has a strong sniffing capability that can be useful for breaking Bluetooth protocols and locating vulnerabilities. You can find this hacking tool on Amazon. USB Killer. Last but not least, we are going to introduce the most sensitive hacking tool, the USB Killer. It looks like an innocent USB flash drive, but it's anything but harmless. When plugged into a USB port, it rapidly charges capacitors before releasing a high-voltage electrical surge back into the host device. This can fry the device's sensitive components, rendering it permanently unusable. The USB killer is usually designed to resemble a regular USB flash drive or other innocent-looking USB devices. This disguise makes it easy to go unnoticed, and increases the likelihood of unsuspecting victims connecting it to their devices. This tool is uncontrollable, as once it's connected to a device, it delivers the electrical surge without any means for the attacker to control or stop it remotely. 
This lack of control makes the damage uncontrollable and potentially catastrophic. USB killers are dangerous and destructive devices designed to cause irreversible damage to electronic devices by delivering high-voltage electrical surges when connected to a USB port. The use of USB killers is prohibited in some countries, but you can use them for ethical hacking, as this tool is available on Amazon. That pretty much wraps this video up, guys. Make sure to subscribe to this channel with a bell notification if you enjoy watching our content. We upload some pretty awesome stuff here, which you will most certainly enjoy. Hit a like on this video and leave a comment below. See you guys in the next one.